This whole thing is heartbreaking. Just saw one of my besties when I was out in a run. Initial reaction, hug that badass. But you can't, and you're both standing away as if like, you don't even know each other. About two meters, just bantering, but yeah, this thing, this is heartbreaking, man. Isolation run complete. Right, it's time to get straight into it. Three ways we will all get through this. Man. Excuse my sweatiness. I've also just realized I've been rolling with this upside down, but let's keep it upside down. Point number one, be nicer. Yes, be nicer. So, do you know when you thought you were being nice before all this, right? You've got to be that extra bit nicer now. Reason I say this, out for a run, right? And the only thing we can do, everyone's conscious of everyone like spacing this two meter rule, which is amazing and you should be doing it. But that doesn't mean that you can't smile at people. That doesn't mean that you can't say hello. People are still people. It's slowly becoming really aware to me from the short times that I'm out and the distance that I am from people. People are really cautious and people are almost looking at each other different. We are all still the same people. We're all still humans. Let's just be nicer, right? Let's just smile at people more. Let's just say hello to people more. It's, we're all in this together. Point number two, ditch the Sarbe Alexander, right? We all have that friend or copious friends on Facebook. And as much as they think they're saving the world by being negative, all they're doing is bringing you down, right? Let's just say we're in isolation for say like two months, right? And every single day of your life, you're on Facebook and looking and checking and Sarbe Alexandra is still piping off with the death toll and is still piping off with someone said this and the world is gonna end and all. It's not gonna end. We've got two choices in this. We can either stay negative and like really struggle through the two months or we can just say, these are the cards that are being dealt and we get on with. We smile, we say, I am dealing with what I've currently got. I am gonna be the best me today and we smile and we get through it. We're not smiling at what's going on because clearly it's a bad situation, but we are sure as hell not being negative and feeling like we've got to add to the whole negativity and BS that is going with us. Ditch the sorry, Alexandra. Get on with your life. Here, I'll let you into a quick tip. Do you know on Facebook and on Instagram, you can hit that unfollow button. Those are to be used in the times where someone's that little bit much. You can unfollow her. And she still appears as your friend, but you don't have to listen to that mentalist they told you. Finally, point number three, productivity. This is your chance, right? So I'm gonna start the hashtag, hashtag I'm improving, right? This time, let's again use the example of two months. You've got two months of like isolation and staying away from people. So you have two months to make you a better person. Always improving. If that's going for lonely runs, if that's going and doing home workouts in your garage in the morning, if that's starting to paint, if that's starting to learn a language, if that's starting to decorate the house, if that's starting to fix the garden, if that's polishing and washing the car a million times, if that's having civilized conversations, if that's taking that, do you remember that social silence or the digital detox you wanna do? Is this not the best time for it? For me personally, I love creating videos, hence this is why I'm doing this. So this is, a, this is like a, an outlet for me. So in isolation, I'll probably be making a lot more videos because I love making videos. I love editing videos. This whole process is amazing to me. Do I get a kick out of consuming stuff? No, it brings me down massively. So I am hashtag I'm improving. So I am getting a better person. I'm using this time for my benefit. We as a population will get through this on the other side as better people. 1000%. We'll maybe realize how negative and annoying social media has been and how overtaking it's been for our life. We need to check the news in the morning to keep up to date with current affairs, but we do not need to check what Sarbri Alexander is saying. We need to be productive. We need to be doing stuff to get us through all this. This is a time for us to improve. This is a time for us to develop. So no excuses, get on it. You're now, you're alone. You and the partner, you and the family. So yeah, make a better you. Yeah. Have an amazing day, people, and let's 
let's look for the positives and things. This is a time for us to come together, smile and be happy. Respect what is going on. Respect the social distancing. Let's not take the piss. So we can do this. Got this. Yes.